Okay. This is Yggdrasil, the tree of life. It's a holy tree, and its life force is entwined with that of the world. Okay. Aradia gives Yggdrasil the power to grow. As the tree grows stronger, so too does the world. With enough Aradia, you can extend its life and push back the Day of Destruction. Up to 13 days, after which God awakens. So the more Aradia I can collect, the bigger that tree will grow. And the bigger the tree, the longer the world has before Doomsday. Okay. Replenish items, check the tree's condition, and talk to Ho. Whoa. I have 5 EP. I want a regular potion. These are too good. I should get a phoenix down. Definitely, if I die. Hmm. All right, I'm gonna get those four, that's it. Stand silently, offer a ready to extend the world's remaining time. Talk to Hope. There are certain areas within Nova Chrysalia that I want you to focus on. Five locations where I'm picking up anomalous chaos readings. And I'm guessing one of those locations is right where snow is. Hmm. Yes, exactly. The palace in the city of Yusnod. There is another spot in the heart of Luxarian, the holy city. One more in the scorching sands of the dead dunes. Okay, these are the and four finally, areas. I've measured large chaos fluctuations at two locations in the wildlands. Hmm. Four regions, five locations. To be more precise, the goals are people, not places. Right. For example, the chaos activity in and around Snow's palace is linked to him, and the darkness in his heart. It's the same kind of chaos that I'm picking up in the other four locations. And you want me to find these five people? They're your priority, yes. Those people have massive burdens on them. The fate of many rest on their shoulders, and that makes your task all the harder. Helping them will not be easy, even for God's handpicked savior. But I can help you. All right, side quest we know about. What about lost time? In this world, all the clocks count to 12, but that wasn't always the case. Back in the old days, all clocks went to 13. Sure they did. Somehow, <laughs> when the chaos first flooded into the world, we lost that 13th hour. It was one of the great mysteries. No one could figure it out. But happen, it did. And the results were dramatic. Space-time has been damaged. Where once each day lasted 26 hours, now only lasts 24. Two hours of every day, gone, just like that. The lost time. Huh. All right, I guess that's it. We gotta go back. I guess not. What am I supposed to do? What other tasks are there in the Ark? You told me I gotta talk to him about everything? Light, do you understand your role now? You must lift the shackles that bind people's hearts and save their souls. The more souls you save, the more Aradia you can harvest. That is crucial because it means buying the world more time. Can I leave? Come on. No, what the fuck? I don't want to talk to Hope anymore. They're going to make me talk to him about every fucking thing. I'm here to help. Ugh. The destruction began 500 years ago, but you know that. It was when the chaos first flooded into our world. Most of the world was lost immediately under the ocean of chaos. Only one small region survived. The survivors call their island of refuge Nova Chrysalia. The chaos brought destruction and a kind of immortality too. Suddenly everyone stopped growing. It was like we'd lost our time. But if that was a gift, it was a poisoned one. We could not age and neither could new life be born. There were no more children. This was canon for Final we Fantasy 13 1? We I don't remember this. Death. Sickness, accidents, and violence could still kill us. Life remained as fragile as it had always been. 
And so humanity began a new chapter of its history. The population slowly shrinking, the survivors falling into an ennui born of lives that last too long. Eventually, new creeds took hold and new legends created. One of these told of the Savior, a servant of God. She would descend to Nova Chrysalia at the end of the world. Humanity's last chance for salvation. Alright, there's gotta be something else they want me to do. What didn't I do? Kill myself! Jump off the goddamn edge and kill myself! Look, there's nothing else to fucking do! What the fuck? Hope you stupid shit! I guess I have to keep talking to him. Yeah, I can't even check this out. I have to keep talking to Hope. This is bullshit. What is it? Side quest. There's a hard truth we must <clears throat> face. There are thousands of people down in the world waiting to be saved, but you cannot help all of them. It's not possible. I've only got a handful of days. There just isn't enough time, right? This will sound cold, but you need to be efficient. Saving people who are suffering under the heaviest burdens will give you more Aradia, which is good for us. But the greater the burden, the more you might have to do before that soul can be saved. Sometimes, solving someone's problem might just take too long. You're saying I shouldn't waste time on helping the hard cases. I've got to pick and choose who gets saved. Huh. Of course it would be best if you could save everyone, but you can't. It's a numbers game, Light. The more souls you save, the more Aradia you can gather and offer to the tree. Uh -uh. The time spent helping one person might be better spent saving the souls of ten others. Efficiency by volume, is that it? And there's no way to know what's best. Game, like you say, control costs and maximize profits. What is it that they say? Time is money. Alright. The work device was unlocked, you fucking idiot. Couldn't just do it before? Fucking silly shit. Alright. So you don't even level up in this game, you just complete quests, and the quests basically give you the stat bonuses. I've noticed that there's no leveling, there's no levels at all. Huh. What the hell? What happened? Where am I? Uh... Where what? am I? What is this? Teleported to the wrong spot. Hey, Savior! What's going on? Oh shit. <laughs> you Where is again? she? Right. Can you hear me? Are you alright? Where are you? What's the problem? Equipment trouble? I'm out. I'm getting crazy readings. The coordinates make no sense. I can't pinpoint your position. What the fuck? Hope? Are you there? Great. No, no, no. Hope can't hear you or see you. You're invisible. Do you know why? Because we're inside you. Spooky, huh? What? You mean inside my mind? Yeah. No, inside it's your cooch. It's a place that God can't see. You could almost say it's like, oh, I don't know, an unseen realm. All right, if you say so. But that begs the question, what the hell are you doing in here? I have a name. It's Lumina, and I know a lot about you. Hmm. <laughs> uh, you need my advice, and in here we can talk about anything we want. Safe from prying eyes. Prying eyes? You mean hope? Yep. He might not realize it, but everything he learns gets passed straight on to God. What of it? I don't have any secrets to hide. Oh, right. You're the loyal servant, aren't you? You wouldn't dream of betraying him. And don't worry, okay? Even if I know otherwise, well, my lips are sealed. I have no reason to betray what? him. Right, right. That's very convincing. Keep those feelings hidden and play the loyal little servant. You want to be as cold as a steel in your sword. You do that, and then no one can guess what's inside. Huh. It's true, God can't see into human hearts. 
But he can read your face and tone, just like anyone else. And make his own guesses. Like I said, I don't have anything to hide. He's promised to bring Sarah back. I'm not gonna do anything that might cause him to change his mind. Why should I? Yeah, but she still resents God for making a deal Maybe? like that. Why are you afraid? Huh? Come on, think about it. We're inside your mind. Don't you get it? If you can't be true to yourself here, where can you? I know you haven't changed, because you can't. <sighs> what the hell are you? Huh. We're, We're just, just particles, particles of dust, dust brushed, brushed from the palm, palm of a god. god. That's, That's all, all we ever were. were. What the fuck? Like I told you it was Sarah. No she way. looks just like Sarah. It's Sarah. Huh. I knew it. That was... That was Sarah. I knew it. Dun dun dun. Plot twist. Even though we all expected it anyway. back to the fucking game. Now we're going to have to run around the city looking at these symbols on the walls to get this number combination to go inside that door. Right. Right. And if we don't figure it out by tonight, another girl will be sacrificed. I don't want that on my conscience. You have to hurry. And stay alert for the Shadow Hunter. Well, I gotta find these things. I don't know where the fuck they are. This is the cathedral. Lightning is sexy, this guy just said. Nice. Thanks for that insightful info. Appreciate it. Frame rate is garbage, by the way. Look how choppy the fucking frame rate is, dude. A half hour already fucking passed. Are you serious? How am I supposed to figure anything out in this game when you have limited time and time passes so goddamn fast? Look at this. This is the kind of game where like you need to know what to do or you're fucked. Another fine day. I don't see any any of these markers I'm supposed to be looking for in here. Nothing. It's a dead end. There's nothing here. God damn it. What am I supposed to do? Fuck. Frame rate is shit. Oh my god. Right now the frame rate is terrible. God forgive those who Great. Look, I've only 50 minutes wasted because I ran in the wrong direction. There's no way to know where to fucking go. What a great game. What a great fucking game. What am I supposed to do? <laughs> and then the strategy guide purposely costs $25. Probably so you have to buy it to play the game. What the fuck? Am 
my god, the frame rates. This is the worst frame rate of any of the 13 series by far. It's terrible. Oh, wait a minute. What's this? In order to infiltrate the children of Adam. A key to unlock right. his and door. If we don't figure it out by tonight, another girl will be sacrificed. I don't want that on my conscience. You have to hurry. And stay alert for the Shadow Hunter. That's great. Where the fuck do I go, Hope, you stupid fuck? The game tells you nothing. Just fucking figure it out. Good luck. Good luck, asshole. Get your freshly baked muffins here. What a nice morning. What the fuck? Where am I going now? I don't even know where I am. I'm lost. There's fucking stupid guitarists here. Who are these assholes? They're playing music. Fuck these idiots. Where the fuck are the things on the wall? Tell me. Where are the symbols? Where are the fucking symbols? Where are they? Is the chaos slow? This is all right. I see an arrow on my map. It's just to go north. See that? See, there's a blinking arrow on the on the mini map. So I gotta try to go north. If you're in need of a room, look no further. You'll find our hotel right along this street. Wow, fuck you. We have the best service in the whole city. I'm wasting a whole fucking day. It's already 7.30. I don't know where the fucking numbers are. Where are the numbers? Where are the numbers? Damn it, I'm late. I sense man you shithead worthless citizens, tell me where the numbers are. Tell me where dentists. Tell me where the numbers are. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I can't move. Train schedule. What the fuck do I want that for? Who are the drugs for? Tell me where that is. <laughs> I know it. Exactly yes. What you want, young miss? You're after the password, aren't you? Yes, I the am. The one that the goddess's followers use. Yes. No, no, don't try and deny it. All I'm interested in is the color of your money. What? I've seen their code, and I'm willing to tell you what I know. For a price. Oh, wow. Not one thing. The code I saw was on a wall down in the centrum. Centrum. So if you've seen it already, then there isn't much point in paying me for it. Yes, I'll just buy it. Fuck it. Give me the code. Five. Good, good. Very smart. Time is money, huh? A handful of gill for extra time. That is a wise investment. There. Good, he gave me one of the numbers. You need three more numbers until you can crash the heretic's party. They have to be... See, I have a conundrum. But, but this one... You know, oh my not... god, shut up. The heretics don't keep an eye on unusual occurrences in town. Look for people behaving strangely to something out of the ordinary. Huh. Maybe they've seen something that's connected to the code. I'll have to look around for people behaving strangely. Are you behaving strangely? What about you? You look suspicious, you bitch. 